Before we start, please hear a message from International News Today Network. Starting today, for every subscriber, International News Today Network will plant one tree to save our planet. Please help contribute in saving our planet by subscribing to our channel. One subscriber equals one tree. Thanks. A Brazilian volunteer soldier, fighting alongside Ukrainian soldiers, has been killed in a Russian military strike, according to Daily Beast. Felito du Valle was a Brazilian model who was killed when a when Russian forces hit a bunker she was stationed at in Karpov, the report further said. The 39-year-old, a sniper, fought against the Islamic State in Iraq before joining the fight in Ukraine, the Beast said. Another Brazilian fighter Douglas Burigo was also killed in the missile strike, which comes just three weeks after Du Valle arrived in Ukraine. She had been posting videos of her journey and training in Ukraine on YouTube and TikTok. Du Valle received sniper training after joining Pashamurgas, the armed military forces of the Kurdistan region of Iraq, according to news.com.au. She participated in animal rescues with various NGOs, the outlet further said. Meanwhile, Russian troops are engaged in heavy fighting with the Ukrainian forces for the control of the Donetsk region. This comes a day after Moscow declared victory in the neighboring province of Luhansk. Russian forces struck a market in a residential area in the city of Slavyansk near front lines in Donetsk, killing at least two people and injuring seven, according to officials, according to news agency Reuters. Ukrainian officials have called on civilians to urgently evacuate Slavyansk as Russian troops press towards it. This week there hasn't been a day without shelling, Pavlo Kyrilenko, governor of the Donetsk region, said on Tuesday evening, adding that the city was now within range of Russian multiple rocket launchers. The enemy is shelling chaotically, the attacks are aimed at destroying the local population, he added. Russian-backed separatists have seized two foreign-flagged ships in the southeast Ukrainian port of Mariupol, saying they are now state property, in the first such moves against commercial shipping, according to Reuters.